All right, so you have, listen, I'm going to wind you up a little bit. You have so many belts. Which one is this? This is the Riyadh season belt. Yeah. Uh, we are here to celebrate the beginning of Riyadh season. It's a special commemorative trophy for the winner of this uh, unique event between Angano and Tanzu Fury. And uh, this is just uh, the representation, Tyson Fury, with Mike Tyson, my father, Ali, Fraser, and Angano. Is this the same belt that Joshua won when he beat Ruiz in, during Riyadh season? No, no, that was, uh, uh, they did not fight for the WBC. Uh, so ah, right, that was, a, yeah. This belt here, so this will be the first time you're awarding it to anyone? Yes, it's unique. It's a one, one piece for the winner of this event on the Riyadh season. Do you think that this can become like an annual thing? Will the WBC be bringing other world titles, other weight classes in Riyadh season every year? It could be. Uh, we do the Juneteenth belt for uh, the Freedom Belt, you know, in, in the United States yeah. to commemorate uh, that special uh, season we do in May for the Mexican and the 14th of September, the Independence. So this is our just a special trophies for the winners of those fights and bring a little extra uh, yeah. Uh, art and gifts. Now, we know how long we've been waiting for this WBC title to be defended and possibly to be unified and become undisputed for Tyson Fury. How excited are you that this fight could possibly happen as soon as December 23rd? Very excited. We have worked so much. Many people around the WBC has got all flexibility. Mm. We have not pushed any mandatories that are not the real challenges that most challenge for the world title so we've been uh, patiently waiting we're waiting for joshua even wilder was waiting to fight wilder against joshua yeah but now it is now it's coming now we know there's a rematch possibility here if no matter how this fight goes will the wbc insist that tyson defends this title after this fight yeah, Tyson Fury is uh, the WBC uh, heavyweight champion, regardless, and uh, we are proud, and he's just been waiting to have the great fight that everybody's expecting. What I'm saying is, must he defend his WBC heavyweight championship after Nganu, no matter what? Yes, yes, he must. That's what we want to hear. <laughs> Radio, <laughs> Radio Rahim with Mauricio Suleiman.